55 years ago, President Lyndon Baines Johnson signed the National Foundation on the Arts and Humanities Act into law, which created the National Endowment for the Arts and the National Endowment for the Humanities. In the long history of man, countless empires and nations have come and gone. Those which created no lasting works of art are reduced today to short footnotes in history's catalog. Art is a nation's most precious heritage, for it is in our works of art that we reveal to ourselves and to others the inner vision which guides us as a nation. The new law stated, while no government can call a great artist or scholar into existence, it is necessary and appropriate for the federal government to help create and sustain not only a climate encouraging freedom of thought, imagination, and inquiry, but also the material conditions facilitating the release of this creative talent. And it has. Here's the National Endowment for the Arts. The National Endowment for the Arts was created to nurture American creativity, to elevate the nation's culture, and to sustain and preserve the country's many artistic treasures. At its core, the National Endowment for the Arts is a grant-making agency, with more than 80% of its annual budget distributed as grants and awards to arts projects in each of America's 435 congressional districts, including the District of Columbia and America's five territories. The National Endowment for the Arts is committed to ensure that every American in every community in every neighborhood has access to the arts. Almost two-thirds of its grants go to small and medium-sized organizations, with 40% of its activities taking place in high-poverty neighborhoods and 35% reaching underserved populations, such as veterans, the disabled, and those in rural areas. Over the last half century, the National Endowment for the Arts has supported epic projects and some of America's most enduring. Poetry Out Loud, a national program that encourages the study and dynamic presentation of great poetry, recited by high school students from across the nation. Its folk and traditional arts funding celebrates and supports art projects that are as creative and diverse as America itself. Our Town, the National Endowment for the Arts signature program that supports partnerships with local artists, arts organizations, and municipal governments, all to improve and revitalize neighborhoods. And its eminently popular Blue Star Museums program, in partnership with Blue Star Families and more than 2,000 museums in all 50 states, provides free admission to active duty military personnel and their families. Today, the National Endowment for the Arts continues to move forward as a pioneer, partner, and supporter of innovative and exciting new perspectives on art, such as its Creative Forces Community Connection Projects. The National Endowment for the Arts collaborated in the creation of a national program linking returning service members suffering from post-traumatic stress disorder with art that has produced results that are as deeply moving as they are profound in advancing recovery. The National Endowment for the Arts, a legacy of success for all of America. For 55 years, the National Endowment for the Arts has been working to make sure all Americans have access to the arts. Cheers to 55 more.